I promised a friend I'd have this log carved into a snow owl bite today. It's a carving for his mom's birthday, so I need to get it done ASAP. It is my fault, I forgot about it. So first thing this morning, I woke up and found a log to use. I had to come up with a quick design for it with a mama and a baby snow owl. We're gonna get the bark on. There's gonna be three main steps in getting this carving done. Number one is shaping out the design. Number two is the detailing, and number three is the finishing. We'll start by cutting out the outline. The mama's gonna be right here, and the baby will be down here. I have to work out of my little shed because there's a snowstorm blowing in. And it's already nine o'clock, so we better get carving. I'll stop and show you where I'm at so far. We got the big owl shaped out. Got his feet here. His face where his beak and eyes will be. The baby owl's head will be right here. And then we're gonna finish shaping out the rest of the log. But first we gotta sharpen our saw. <laughs> We have the shaping all done. Next, we're gonna get a smaller saw and move on to step two, detailing. gouging tool to put the bark texture on the stump. It should help it look more like my sketch. But first I gotta clean up some of this sawdust. You can see here the gouging tool is attached to another saw. Okay, I got all the detailing done, but I gotta get moving because I'm almost out of time. It's cold out. It's probably 10 degrees right now, but the wind is blowing so hard. We're gonna shut this door and get the fire built up. Then we're gonna move on to step three, finishing. It's looking pretty close to the sketch so far. I have two hours left before he picks it up, so we have to burn it, then sand it, then paint it. Big relief getting the airbrushing done. Now it just has to dry. If you like unique wood carvings like this, try checking out this video next.